Blessed love and blessed day. Oh, boxing world, boxing nation, fighting world, fighting nation. This coach finest is real life boxing. Y'all already know where I'm at. I'm at the boxing gym. Y'all hear the bell. Y'all hear the ropes going in the back. Javante Tank Davis has confirmed that this will be, well, the fight on Saturday against Rolando Rolly Romero will be his last fight with Mayweather Promotions. So I want to talk about it real quick. But before we get started, you guys already know what to do. Best double jab straight down the pipe. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and the bell icon so you can be notified when all content is being uploaded on the channel of Real Life Boxing. Young man over here doing his abs. Y'all already know it's Sugar J. Josh in the gym early. Y'all already know Sugar J said he got sparring today. I mean, he's amped. He's amped. So, yeah, Javante Tank Davis, last day in podcast. Javante Davis has confirmed that Rolly Romero fight on Saturday night will be his last with Mayweather promotions. I feel I need to be, in quotations, I feel I need to be the one that controls my career. I feel I need to be the one in control of my career at this point. It's time. Everybody don't need to have training wheels on them forever. You know what I mean? I think, you know, I got the skills to pay the bills. I got a good team around me, my trainers, Coach Calvin, you know, he's like a dad. He's been like a dad and like a mentor figure for me, you know, for my whole life. So I think that it's time that I could take the training wheels off. That was, excuse me, that's my uh, my Tank Davis imitation. I like to imitate Tank, man. The way Tank talks is crazy. But this conversation be coming up a lot. Y'all see it popping up. Me personally, my thoughts on it, um, I don't, necessarily think that well I, I think the tank is gonna leave Mayweather promotions but not necessarily um, PBC the Showtime Uncle Al you know how it works and um the dude the dude um what's his name the dude at Showtime I, 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 I get these dudes mixed up um but the dude at Showtime he was doing an interview and they asked him um Steven Espinoza, is that the dude from Showtime? Yeah, and they asked him, y'all let me know in the comment section. I think it's Steven Espinoza. And then they asked him, um, what was his thoughts about this being Javante's last fight with Mayweather Promotions? And, and he confirmed that, you know, even though Javante will be leaving Mayweather Promotions, he won't be leaving Showtime. He won't be leaving the brand. You know what I'm saying? And that's what I figured. Inside of PBC, Uncle Al, you know what I'm saying? Ella Lellaby, Leonard Ellerby, there's multiple like promotion companies and you know i'm saying in mayweather promotions floyd's joint is just um it's just one of them you know what i mean so i really think that that tank i don't know if he's gonna sign like a you know like a network deal with showtime if they're gonna offer him that but i do think that he stays with uncle al and um you know in the showtime brand apart from that um, maybe just come a free agent and kind of do do what Carnelo Alvarez does. You know what I'm saying? One fight here, one fight there, one fight here, one fight there. If Roley, um, it seems like, you know, he's ready for these big fights, hence why he was so frustrated that they made him fight, um, not Roley, Tank. Um, Tank feels like he's ready for the big fights, hence why he's so frustrated with them making him fight Roley. But... We all know how PBC does business in that brand. Like they don't really want to do no out of house fights, especially with their big name fighters that can that can potentially um, lose. So I think you know Tank is calling for Devin Haney. You know if Devin Haney beats Cambosis, so you know how they go. Devin Haney had to go over to ESPN to um get that fight. Everybody's like, oh, why did he leave Eddie? Why? That's another thing. I don't necessarily think that Devin. Um, left Uncle Eddie Hearn. I just think that to get that fight, you know, certain fights, Bob is like, okay, we could do co-promotion. And certain fights, Bob is not willing to do co-promotion. And, excuse me, same thing with PBC. Certain fights, certain fighters, they will do the co-promotion, you know, for, but certain fighters and certain promoters, they're not willing to do the co-promoting with, you know what I'm saying? Just like Isak Cruz in and uh and ryan garcia but um i think that it's, it's, it should be a good look for tank you know what i mean i think that you know tank said i feel i need to be the one that's in control of my you know of my career it's that time you know what i mean like everybody doesn't need training wheel training wheels on them forever so 
obviously Tank feels like he's ready for bigger fights and he should be getting bigger fights. And um, he may have to come from underneath the Mayweather banner, you know what I mean, to get those big fights accomplished. But uh, you guys tell me what y'all think about it in the comments section. I got the sweat being on. Drinking my tea, just finished working with the little ones. And, um, you know, we got outside sparring coming in today. Some of these boys, Sugar J. Josh, sparring today. So, I mean, we in the gym working. But you guys tell me what y'all think about it in the comment section. Tank leaving Mayweather. Um, you know, is he staying with Uncle Al and PBC in the Showtime, um, you know, brand over there? You guys let me know what y'all think about it in the comment section. Until then... We got an exciting uh, fight on Saturday, you know what I mean? Um, you guys protect yourself at all times and keep fighting your fight, man. Peace and one love.